Hi guys and welcome to my channel. I am going to be showing you how to make this gorgeous stunner right here um, and a few easy steps. So let's go, let's get started. You're going to be needing a few things but what we, I'm doing here is I'm using a two-part epoxy made by Swarovski. The link is in the description of exactly what you will be needing. Um, it's in epoxy resin glue. <clears throat> And you're going to be using it to basically paint over the pre-sanded, I had already sanded the license plate frame by the time I decided to make this video. I also have a blog post that will be written on how to do this as well so that you get more detailed instructions. But I wanted to get this done because I'm telling, I'm telling you it has been weeks that I've had this and I have gone over the voice recording and editing and I'm not a YouTube guru at all. so. Bear with me here. Um, and finally, I just said, I've got to get it up. I've got to get it up and done. So basically what you're going to do is you're going to pre-sand the frame and the caps. Um, you're going to get it to where it's just got enough of a, a surfaced um, texture. And then you're going to clean it with an alcohol swab or an alcohol wipe um, until it comes back completely clean. And then you're going to take the mixed epoxy that you have and you're going to mix it approximately about a minute and a half to um, two minutes. and once it's mixed, you basically paint it on into a thin layer, and I'm, that's what you can see I'm doing here. I'm painting a thin layer with a, a paintbrush, um, and you can reuse the paintbrush. You just clean it off with some um, rubbing alcohol <clears throat> and reuse it until you can't reuse it anymore. But you use that, and this will withstand weather conditions. It will withstand car washes, um, power washing, anything you can imagine. It, it will withstand it. Um, I have not had a client lose a crystal yet. Um, and then you just paint it onto the surface and as you can see back I had was cleaning the paintbrush in my little cup of alcohol and then you just start applying the crystals you want to make sure that your application technique is straight um, it's going to take some practice it takes a, a long time to learn to practice um, please 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 don't use E6000 don't use um, any type of like gym tack or um, I don't know Gosh, I can't think of any glues. Don't use anything that's that's not, um, let's see, E6000 or like a nail glue for this. Make sure to use this glue. It's a little pricey, but it is so, so worth it. And you're going to use about less than a dime size of each part because it comes in two different parts, part A and part B. And you're going to use less than a dime size amount, equal amounts, mix them together, and paint that onto there. And it those crystals won't budge so um, it is is very well worth the money and you have to consider too that um, you're paying a lot of money for these Swarovski crystals and you really really do not want them going anywhere um, make sure to keep going back and checking your placement of your crystals because they will slide with this glue just make sure that you go back and just as you can see that I'm doing I keep going back and back to make sure because they'll slide and they'll move um, repeatedly once you start doing this, don't leave and try and go somewhere else. It's not going to work that way. Um, finish your project. Um, if for some reason you do have to go somewhere, you can simply take um, an alcohol swab and use it to wipe away any glue that you have left over or that you have uncompleted um, so that it doesn't set there. Uh, but that's just if you happen to have to leave. Um, it's going to take you about an hour, hour and a half, depending on your speed, to get this completed from start to finish. So, anyway, thank you guys for your patience. Thank you for watching. Um, subscribe because I will be doing live videos and tutorials, as well as more DIYs with blinging things, strossing things, and making this world a little bit sparklier. So, thank you guys for watching so much. Have a good day and enjoy the rest of the video.